Hello everyone. Welcome back to another exciting After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn to create this. So, without further ado, let's jump right in and explore the creative process together. Open Adobe After Effects, then create a new composition. Name it Flip Text Animation. Set the resolution to 1920 by 1080 pixels, 30 frames per second, and set the duration to 5 seconds. Now we need a vector file for this tutorial. So let me import the required vector file. Choose the flipboard vector file, then click on import. Ensure that the import type is set to composition and then click OK. Double click on the flipboard composition. As you can see, we have a separate layer for the flipboard. The flipboard is comprised of top, bottom, and design layers. Select the type tool from the toolbar and type any letter you want. Increase the font size. Center the anchor point. Then align your text to the center. Remember, this part is really important in the tutorial. Please watch it carefully. If you get this part, the rest of the tutorial will be a breeze for you to understand. Next, duplicate the top layer two times. Select both duplicate layers and move them just above the text layer. Select the text layer. Click this toggle, switches mode button. Go to track mat, and choose alpha mat. Select these three layers. Right click on them, and choose pre-compose. I am calling it L1. This is the top part of our first letter. To create the bottom part of the L letter, Retype the letter L. And ensure the anchor point is centered. Then align the L letter to the center. Next, select the bottom vector layer, duplicate it twice, and drag this layer just above the text layer. Select the text layer. Go to track mat, and choose alpha mat. Select these three layers. Right click on them and choose pre-compose. I am calling it L2. Now, we have created a bottom part of the L letter. Move the L2 layer, just above the L1. Select these two layers. Click the toggle switches, mode button, and enable the 3D option. Select the L2 composition layer and press R to open rotation properties. Change the X rotation to negative 90 degrees because we don't need any text to be appear at the beginning. Select the top three layer, and press R to open rotation properties. Add a keyframe on X rotation. Move forward to 15 frames. Then change the X rotation to positive 90 degrees. Select the L2 layer, and open rotation properties. Add a keyframe at 15 frames. Then go to 15 frames forward. Then change the X rotation value back to 0 degrees. Let's see the preview. Cool. The first letter flip has been successfully completed. Select all layers. Right click. And choose pre-compose. I am calling it L. Go to the main composition. Drag and drop the L composition into the main composition. Press S to open scale properties. And decrease the scale to 50%. Let's check it again. Our first flip text letter is ready. Remember, this part is crucial. If you find it confusing, take some time to watch it again. Now, let's create a second letter composition. Choose the L composition. Duplicate it, and rename the duplicate to O. Double click on it. You'll see L1 and L2 compositions inside. We need to change them by O letter. So, duplicate L1, 
Rename it to O1. Duplicate L2, rename it to O2. Or use labels, like O top, and O bottom if you prefer. Inside O1 composition, replace the L, with O. Then align it to the center. Repeat the same process for the O2 composition. Go to the O composition. Pick the L2 composition, hold down the Alt key on your keyboard, and drag the O2 composition onto the L2 composition. This action will replace the compositions. Select the L1 composition, hold down the Alt key on your keyboard, and drag the O1 composition onto the L1 composition. Great! Our second flip text letter is created. Head back to the main composition. Drag the O letter composition just below the L composition. Reduce its scale and position it closer to the L letter. Now, let's proceed with creating the V letter flip. I strongly recommend watching every part of this tutorial without skipping. Following each step diligently is crucial for achieving accurate results. Once you finish watching the whole tutorial, you'll be able to make your own flip text animation. I've made it easy, especially for beginners. Now, let's work on the final letter, which is the letter E. Duplicate the V letter composition, and rename it to E. Inside the E composition, you'll find V1 and V2 compositions. We need to create and replace them by E1, and E2. Duplicate V1, rename it to E1. Duplicate V2. Rename it to E2. Enter the E1 composition, and replace the letter from, V to E. Inside the E composition, Choose the V2 composition. Hold down the Alt key on your keyboard and drag the E2 composition onto the V2 composition. This action will replace the compositions. Cool. The final letter flip is now complete. In the main composition, drag and drop the E composition just below all layers, reduce its scale. and adjust its position. Select all layers, then use the align tools to distribute them horizontally and vertically for a polished look. With all layers selected, adjust their position to ensure they are centered on the screen. Let's preview the animation. Cool. It looks perfect to me. However, all letters are flipping simultaneously. Let's adjust the timing to make them flip individually. To achieve individual flips, we simply need to adjust the position of the keyframes in our animation sequence.
Let's preview the animation again. Cool. Now, our letters are flipping individually. Let me demonstrate how to change the text. You can modify each letter by accessing its respective composition. I'll share the project file with multiple text flip animations. Let me do it faster to save your time. I'm simply modifying the letters directly within their respective compositions. For example, if I need to change the letter L, I make adjustments within the L1 and L2 compositions text. Let's see the final output. Amazing. I am happy with the results. Our flip text animation is completed. I will share the project file with multiple flip text animations. You can download everything from my website. If you enjoyed this tutorial, explore my other videos for more exciting content. Show your support by liking, subscribing, and sharing your thoughts in the comments. If you gained new knowledge, consider supporting the channel. Thanks for watching and good luck. See you in the next tutorial.